So it turns out we have some unfinished business from our last Haunted Items episode. Today I'm joined by my friend, Chelsea. Hey. Chelsea is a medium and she has the ability to tap into the other realm. So I thought she'd be a great person to bring to see what she can find out about some of the other haunted items that we didn't go over. But the interesting thing is, after I took a look at the Nova Scotia hangings list, turns out that there was a gentleman by the name of Omar Roberts that was hung in Yarmouth County, Nova Scotia. And if you remember, I got a hit on the holy water bottle. It stated that it was Roberts and that he was hung. So Chelsea, let's get into it. Let's get the first one out of the way. All right. Um, I showed this to you earlier. Mm -hmm. What was the first thing you said? My stomach turned and automatically I had anxiety for it. And I don't even want to touch it, to be honest. Do you want me to hold it? Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. So we're going to do just sort of like a baseline uh, on this. Actually, I'm going to get Spirit Talker. Okay. Mm hold on. Okay, so we've got Spirit Talker on. We're going to let that go. See what that says. I'm also feeling really dizzy. That's not good. No. I don't know why, though. I think it has something to do with one of those, for sure. Holy water bottle. I'll hold it for you. Okay. We'll do a baseline read. See if you pick up anything besides anxiety. Some sadness, but I also get the visual of a man lying in, like, a twin bed with white sheets pulled right up to his face. Dead or alive? He looks alive. He's blinking. It's pulled right up to his sheets, and he's, like, holding it, and he's, like, shivering. Okay. We're going to put that right here. I'm going to get the jousing rods out. The anxiety that Chelsea is feeling, is it her own? Not very strong, but I'd say that's a no. I'd say that's a no as well. Okay. Robert, were you anxious to pass away? I would also say that's a no. I'd say that's a no as well. I'm picking up, like, um, it wasn't that he was anxious to pass, but he was more anxious for his, like, loved ones or family. Because I see a couple people standing around the bed. Were there people around you at the time of your death? Yes. Yeah. And that was like a strong yes. Thank you. Was your wife with you? I'd say that's a no. Mm -hmm. What about your children? Did you have children? No. No. I wonder if they were workers of the jail. Yeah, maybe. Emma. Who is Emma? Mistress. Ooh. More like a lover of some sort, maybe not a wife, but... Was Emma special to you? Like a hesitation mm -hmm. with a yes. Butcher. Emma the Butcher? That sounds badass. <laughs> that does sound really badass. <laughs> what, what kind of butcher? Like for animals or for humans? It's getting a no. <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, there's also a possibility that Emma Butcher is a full name. See, I didn't even think of that part. Yeah, that's logic. <laughs> <laughs> Emma the Butcher. It's <laughs> a dope name. It is. Okay. I'm getting like, um, there's nothing that you can really do to help with it, but he's thankful that it's out of where it was and that it's in like a nicer spot. Oh. Mm -hmm. So okay. he, he likes where you have it. Okay. Mm hmm that's good. But he says, don't move it constantly. Little boy. And that's ironic that it says that. Because it's something to do with the whistle. <gasps> what? Okay, let's move along. <laughs> oh, that's so cool that it said that, though. That just, like, confirms my 
like thing that I just had with the whistle before. Mm -hmm. That's really cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, okay, one last thing regarding the spirit who is attached to the holy water bottle. Nose ring. Nose ring, and it just went to yes. You don't have a nose ring? I do not. Neither do I. Maybe Emma Butcher did. <laughs> she was seriously something. Yeah. I want to be her friend. <laughs> oh my god. So we will cohabitate in peace then. And then it just got a stronger no. Yikes. <laughs> Maybe you need some holy water for your holy water bottle. <laughs> How does one get holy water? I think you just go to a church okay. and ask a priest to bless it. I don't know, though. Okay. We gotta move on to this whistle. <laughs> yes. Do you want to hold it? Yes. Okay. So this whistle I picked up. This whistle? It's a beautiful brass whistle. I have a thing for small brass items. So it belonged to a little boy. Okay. And he used to go down to the shoreline a lot, and he would blow it on the beach. Really? Mm -hmm. He's a little boy. He's probably about this tall. He has dark black hair. He's wearing, like, a blue outfit. And he used to love to take this down to the I ocean. And he would blow it. And I live on. Mm -hmm. This whistle has, like, phenomenal energy. It's very, really? Yeah, very playful, very, like, sweet, cute. So I would not blow it because I don't know how old it is. But yeah. he wants you to blow it to keep him to live on. No way. Mm -hmm. I just got like a warm like energy here mm -hmm. on my right shoulder too. I wonder if we can get his name. Okay. Let's let's see. Are you prepared to give us your name? I seriously feel like something is touching my right hand right now. Really? Yeah. That's so cool. It's probably him. And if you have a hard time using these devices, you can use me as your vessel and you can speak to me. Or Kim. Kim also has that same ability. Not quite as strong as you. But <laughs> you're really still strong. got it. Shoes. Shoes. Maybe he's wondering where our shoes are. Maybe. Does your name start with a J? I get like like a J like a Jacob or Oh my god, you just read my mind. <laughs> really? Yes. No way. Yeah, you did. That's so cool. <laughs> I know. We're always so connected. Is your name Jacob? <laughs> yes. Oh my god, my eyes are like watering. That's so cool. That is so cool. The fact that I said it, you thought it, and then that confirmed it. You are like, I'm thinking of Jay. I was like, Jacob, 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 <laughs> Jacob. Her. Are you able to tell me... The time in which you lived? No. Maybe he doesn't know it. Maybe he doesn't. Mm -hmm. The energy from this one is very, like, much stronger than the holy water. I really? think Jacob really wanted his, like, time to shine today. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. I love that. So these are... Where did First of all, where did you get this, this piece that we're about to get? An antique shop. Okay. What's funny is... Um, I already have a set of rosary beads that look identical to this, but they didn't come in a pouch. These came in a pouch and, you know, normally I'd be like, not really interested in something that I already have. There was another couple in the store at the same time and they were like, oh my gosh, look at those black rosary beads. They're amazing. And they're like, they were just having their own conversation about them, but they were like totally enamored with them. And I thought not that special because lots of rosary beads look this way mm -hmm. but then I was like maybe they were onto something too so then I I went to pick it up and as soon as I picked it up I was like yes, yes. mine yeah. mine yeah so I'll give you everything in its entirety as long as you feel comfortable holding it yep. definitely okay oh well they are beautiful they're kind of like um a hint of blue maybe as well yeah? Like a dark onyx blue. You, I think, are right on that. Yeah. It's really pretty. It's like a symbol on here, too, eh? It's, um, I don't remember what those are called. It looks like that, wait. I don't know what that is, actually. But I pick up, like, an older, older person, like an older woman on these ones. Maybe it was one of the names that came through before is your name Anna is your name Anna sure 
Sure. Anna, the church that you used to go to, did it burn down? I'm getting like prospect. What? Like prospect area. No way. Yeah. Is there a church that burned in prospect? I have no clue. That is so interesting. But like it, and like I just keep getting prospect, prospect, and the church that burned. Yeah, I definitely get like an older woman who used to go to church a lot. Something to do with Knights of Columbus. Mm, Knights of Columbus. Mm-hmm. Right. And I also pick up the vibe that like when she passed, kind of the whole family fell apart and they just mostly donated or got rid of a lot of her stuff. Yeah. So I'm going to ask you one more thing. Since you're here, what else is here? <laughs> it's a loaded question. Many of us. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, that's a loaded question. <laughs> yeah, you still have that man who stands outside of your house. I don't know. I had this really strong dream one time about this man who um, was in my living room and he has a beard Mm -hmm. and I don't know if he has hair on his head or not, but he wears overalls. Mm -hmm. Shut up. I've never seen him in your house though. Well, he was in my house and I told him that he had to leave because I own this house now. So when did you tell him that he had to leave? In my dream. Okay. And was this before I, said, I came to your house for the first time? Yeah. Okay. And I said, you have to go. Like, this is my house now. You have to leave. And then he disappeared. And then in my dream, there was a couple who started driving, like, an old sort of Buick. I was treated bad. I'm sorry. Um, they were driving this old Buick, this old black Buick, and it was a couple. And they kind of, like, went down the side of the house, and they went down towards the front lawn area into the tree line but at in my dream there was a very prominent like two tire track road Mm -hmm. that went through there and I'm like that's weird because it's somebody's property like somebody has a house there now so that's strange Mm -hmm. um I got in contact with a person that used to live here this used to be an old farm and um got in contact with a person that used to live in this house and his relatives have all been in this family and this was like a family farm for like the last 250 some odd years so I said to him who are these people and he was like oh that's old man blah 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 and I said well who were the two people that were driving a black Buick probably from like the late 60s early 70s that went down through the tree line but they were on a road and he was like oh that was great uncle blah 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 and also said, yeah, there was a road that used to go down there. And he, like, named the person's property that the road used to go down through. Wow. So, like, I went for a trip back in time to that is really see these people. Cool. So, yes, I am confirming for you that there is a man around mm-hmm. here. So, it's funny because, like, the last time I was at your house, I saw him standing at the end of your house outside. And still, even today, he's still there. But he doesn't come in. So he listens to you, which is why I asked <laughs> if he said that before I came over. Because I don't see him in your house. Okay. But he's on the property. Okay. Mm-hmm. Interesting. It's me making sounds. Oh, yeah. And last time I was doing an episode, as you guys can probably confirm if you have watched it, uh, there was a lot of sounds going on when mm-hmm. I was recording. Mm-hmm. You do have a lot of things back here, too, that hold a lot of energy. Mm-hmm. Any, would you say any are, like really bad um the only one that i get weird energy from is the holy water Mm -hmm. bottle um trying to look quickly i do know that those i remember the day you picked them up right away i was like "Ooh, those are haunted um yeah but i think everything has good energy i'm just a little wary on this i just really don't think you should move it around too much and maybe maybe get it filled even if it's not real holy water but maybe put something in it. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's the only thing that worries me about it. Okay, that's good mm-hmm. advice. Mm-hmm. If anybody learned anything from that, if you have, by chance, an old holy water bottle and it's empty, maybe you too should put some water in it. <laughs> maybe. I got one at home too. Maybe I should put water in that. You should. <laughs> I should. should take my own advice. You should. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for being here Thanks with me, Chelsea. Me. This was so much that's fun. Everything.
on that note. Oh boy. I'll affect everything. Great.